Tasmania's poppy crop is about to get a new lease on life. A factory in the state's north has started producing biodiesel fuel made from poppy seed oil. And authorities are hoping it might eventually produce enough power to drive public transport vehicles. For the past five years, Mike Henry's family has been looking for ways to put waste from Tasmania's poppy crop to better use. With the installation of a new biodiesel plant, that dream is a reality. You can basically substitute uh, fossil diesel straight with biodiesel without any engine modifications. It's taken more than a year to build, but the plant is now up and running and will produce as much as three million litres a year. It's fed by oil pressed from poppy seeds, left over after the crop is harvested. We're focusing on using second generation feedstocks, which basically means they're, they're all waste products. It's the only biodiesel plant in the state and is considered one of the most advanced in the country. The oil is treated several times before it's converted into diesel. The combination of all those pretreatments uh, is meaning that uh, the oil that ends up being turned into fuel is of very high purity. The developers of the factory believe Tasmania is in a unique position to make the most of the technology. High shipping costs and a large poppy crop means producing biodiesel is economically viable. Vegetable oil costs money to sell to the mainland and the diesel costs more here. So there's this unique economic situation and the plant fits really well in this situation. It could drastically change the way public transport operates in Tasmania. If all goes according to plan, the plant will produce enough fuel for Tasmania's entire bus fleet. Jonathan Gould, ABC News, Cressy.